Okay, so what are we looking at today? We're looking at the, um, I, I went in one of my um, dresser drawers, and, and you know what, I found my, you know, because I've moved from one state to the next, and I found my old Ozark trail with the wood handle knife. It's in 440 steel, which I never knew before until I looked it up today. So that's an $8 knife next to one, a $108 knife. So what's the difference? 440 steel, as, um, as the 30V steel, and of course those are the rest of my folders. And um, I took it to work, because since I found it this morning, I took it to work. And you know what it did? It cut paper, it cut cardboard, just as well as uh, the other knife I carried today, which was, because yeah, I carried two knives today. I, um, the Ontario Rat 1, which is an OS 8 steel. The only thing about the uh, this $8 knife is that you're going to have to sharpen it a lot more. And I'm not going to hate on this knife because it's an $8 knife. You know, I'm not a, I'm, I don't want to be a knife snob either. You know, like, well, okay, I'm going to buy knives that are like this one, like the Spyderco Stage, that's 108 bucks, which I bought from Amazon. And of course I bought the um, Ozark knife, Ozark trail knife, for $8 in Walmart. They perform almost the same. Of course, you know, it's, the steel is not as good. You know, there's some rough edges on this knife, you know, and um, this actually, I have a chip in it also that I discovered, but it, it performed well, and uh, the handle, uh, the, I'm sorry, the grip is a little loose, you know, but um, for eight dollars it served me well. So, you know, not to be a knife snob, you know, I like high-end, I like high-end knives, but that's not the end-all to be-all, you know, buy what you like. And, um, yeah, it's going to have to be serviced and maintained much more than higher-end steels. But it's, it's, the knife served me well. And that's all I really want to say in this video. Thank you for watching. You're listening to a little Sal Soul Orchestra. If anyone's wondering, I love old disco. Disco has never died. They just changed the name. They call it club music now, but it's still disco. Thank you for watching. And um, I'll see you again soon. And uh, thank you for all the new subscribers. I do appreciate you. I do watch. Uh, I do appreciate you coming by and watching my videos. Because I'm not a big channel, and uh, really never will be, and really don't care to be. But thank you for watching. And you take care. Enjoy your weekend. Bye bye.